Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Savannah if you're new here and we are doing something a little bit different today on the channel. I wanted to to little, 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 little. Whoa. <laughs> I wanted to do a create a sim challenge today because I've been doing so many let's plays. I thought I would shake it up a bit and do a create a sim challenge. One of you guys wanted me to do the uh, I think it's called like a mystery genetics challenge. I'm not sure. It's the one where you spin a wheel and it decides like how your sim is going to be. I thought this would be really interesting because I really want some more people at like townies and my legacy challenge. So today I'm kind of hoping that we can make someone, a potential someone for Max. <laughs> if you guys don't watch my legacy challenge, Max is the second heir and he is a teenage boy and we are looking for his perfect soulmate. So that's what we're gonna be doing today. We're gonna be spinning some wheels and making a teenage girl. So I hope you guys are excited. Let's get into it. So I'm gonna be using a few different wheels. I'm gonna use the wheels that Claire Siobhan used in her mystery genetics challenge. And I'm also gonna be using Kawaii Stacy's wheels because that one has a bunch of wheels um, that the other one doesn't have and uh, vice versa. So we're gonna be using both today. So like I said, we're be, we'll be making a teenage girl. This girl is really cool. I'm really feeling her look. <laughs> so the first wheel that we're going to be spinning will decide uh, her skin tone. So let's go ahead and just like take all of this off for now. Oh my gosh, she had cat leggings on under her romper. Whoa, okay, cool. Um, yeah, so let's just take all this off. Okay guys, the first wheel we are going to be skin skinning, <laughs> spinning is for skin tone. All right, let's get into it. Let's start this challenge. So there is a wide range of skin tones for this. Okay, so we're gonna have a very pale babe. So pale, I would assume is like these three, cause there's pale, fair, olive, dark, darkest, weird and wonderful. So this one is extremely pale. But does she want like a pink undertone or a yellow undertone? Hmm. Okay, let's go with this one. So I've got a wheel for skin tone. I've got a wheel for hair, eyes, body, style. Okay, so I would assume that the next thing that we would do is like her face. So let's do this one. You choose. Okay, so it was strong features, soft features, or average features. So we get to choose this one, which I'm pretty excited about. So we can pretty much do whatever we want to her face. Um, so let's start with brows. With creative sim challenges, it's like kind of hard for me because I never really know what to say. Like when I'm creating a sim, I just like zone in so hard and I forget to talk. So there's that. Um, it's kind of frustrating, but it's okay. I'll try and talk through this. I love those brows so much. They're very thin, but they're just really nice. These two, I feel like, mm, let's just move them down a little bit. And yeah, these ones I like because they're so like natural looking and just like free. <laughs> these ones are way more tailored. Um, wow, I can't believe those ones, holy crap. A lot of these brows are really bold. I like these too. I think that they are a good like middle ground. Let's go with these ones. I don't think I've used those in a while. So yeah, those are fine for now. And then let's see, I definitely we want her eyes to be bigger. I love big eyes. I think they're beautiful. And this nose, it's perfect. It's perfect. And I think it's too perfect. So let's go ahead and like randomize because we get to choose what kind of features she has. So that's kind of cool. Let's see. Is this the nose that she had before? I love it when noses like flick up like that. I think that's super cute. Let's just drag it like that. Mmm. Let's give her like a super snatched nose. Yeah. Okay, then as far as lips go, let's do some more randomizing until we, ooh. 
I love this mouth. I think it's so cute. I like um, how it doesn't really have like that prominent of a Cupid's bow. And she's got like a little smile going on, <laughs> which I like. Okay, yeah, let's move on to the next wheel, which I would assume would be eyes. So let's do that. Green, green eyes, okay. I love green eyes. Which green do we wanna use though? Do we wanna use my noodle eyes or should we do like a different one like this? These ones are like super realistic. I tend to avoid realistic eyes because they kind of make, oh my gosh, look at this zit. Oh, that's so gross. They kind of make um, your Sims look uh, strange. I don't really know how to explain it, but like they're like, they're so realistic. I like these ones, I think. I've used these before. I just love my noodle eyes. I think they're they're like the perfect eyes. Oh, these ones are actually nice. Oh, these ones too. I've used these a lot in my game. I think they're very subtle, like especially the green color, because with the noodle eyes, the green is like really, really, really bright. Okay, the next wheel is going to be her hair. So this is going to determine the hair color color white oh my gosh white hair okay and then we're gonna do a wheel that's going to decide the hair length this is exciting short okay short interesting okay <laughs> This is definitely making me step out of my shell, that's for sure. So let's do custom content and then let's do short. Uh, or maybe we should just do all. All right, let's see. There's this one, which I've always loved. Um, there is no white hair option for that. I guess this would be the white hair. She's gonna be like a pixie, I swear. Maybe we should do like bright, bright, bright green eyes. I don't know, would you guys consider this short or would you consider that like medium? I'm so glad we didn't get bald. I think she would have pulled off bald actually. She's got like a really pretty face. Oh wow, yeah, that's white. That is white. I actually love that hair on her. I think it looks really good. Let's see if there's anything else. <laughs> I don't really have many short hairstyles. There's this one that I just downloaded, which I think is so cute. I can't wait to use this on some of my boys. I think this one is definitely considered short and it's so cute. It looks so cute on her, but there's no white option. It's all like gray or really, really light blonde. There's this one. That's cute. But I don't know, I think I liked the other one better and I think that is technically considered short. Ooh, look at this one. <gasps> oh, how pretty. But there is still like no white. That's like the whitest. Oh, I love that one. That's definitely an option. I think I liked this one the best. What do you guys think? I don't know, it's either that one or this one. I mean, they're pretty similar. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> Let's just leave this one for now. We can always come back to it. Oh my god, no. No, what am I doing? We can always come back to it, like if there's like a style that she gets that goes better with the other hairstyle, then we could always switch it back. Okay, and I think we should change her eyebrow color too. Maybe to something a little bit lighter. Um, let's see, that one matches, that one's perfect, okay. Okay, what's next? We've done skin tone, we've done hair, we've done eyes, um, there's style left, there's body left, um, there is, oh, makeup and fashion? Oh, we could do skin and body details, that's an interesting one. So there's like piercings, stretch marks, which I don't have, 
perfect teeth, ear piercings, glasses, bad teeth, freckles, um, all that kind of stuff. <sighs> Fingers crossed we don't get something bad like acne. Oh man. Oh, beauty marks. Okay, my girl's gonna have beauty marks. And we also need to apply skin details as well. I can't believe I almost forgot. What is wrong with me? Skin details are life. They really are. It just makes Sims look so like different. It look, makes them look like their own person. This right here, I don't know what this skin detail is called, but it is my favorite. I use it on a lot of my Sims. I just think it's really, really nice. And it adds that like, those two marks on the lips that make your lips look more full. But yeah, I use that one a lot in case you guys were wondering. Oh, doughy skin looks so good on her. Her skin looks perfect. Milky skin, that just makes her like super pale, which I'm okay with. <laughs> All right, where are the beauty marks? There's this one that leaves beauty marks. What's this? Oh, I love that skin detail as well. I have no idea what it's called. Here we go. These are beauty marks. So which beauty marks do we want? All over perhaps, or just like that perhaps. I kind of liked this one. And it goes like all over her body too. Really cute. Okay. Okay, now for, what teeth does she have? Okay, let's move on to makeup, and I think that will go under, like, style. So, we have boho, Kardashian, hipster, streetwear. I feel like that's probably for, like, clothing, and then for this one, where it says makeup and fashion, we can do that for her makeup. Okay, let's spin it for makeup cool what the heck is cool i have no idea what that means <laughs> what does that mean like winged liner but we can't even really see it because her hair <laughs> i guess we could just do whatever we want then yeah oh what about the like the colored liner i think that's really cool like, I always love putting yellow in the waterline. I think that looks so awesome, but I've already done that before in it, with a few of my Sims before. So, let's see. I love the peachy colors. I think that looks really cool. Okay, and she definitely needs lashes, like, for sure. And I really wanna give her piercings, but I'm gonna hold off and see what style we get. <laughs> Cause that will definitely determine if she is a piercings type of girl or not. Pretty. Very pretty. Okay. Okay, and then let's give her some lippy gloss. She straight up looks like a little like fairy girl. Like, um, what do you call them? Pixie. Thank you, brain. <laughs> between that one and that one let's go with that one because it matches her eyeliner you guys she's so pretty already ah should we give her this <laughs> is that like overkill just like way too much let's see do we have one that's like a little less Aww. Aww. It looks like it's glitching with her moles though. I wish it wasn't so harsh. I would totally add it, but I think she's fine the way she is. Okay, now let's do the wheel four. All right, let's do the body wheel. So we got thick, curvy, average, slim, skinny, and athletic. Curvy, beautiful. All right. A curvy, 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 curvy girl. So there's like that one. I have, have these like custom content body types, which give you like curvy or -er sims and like with hip dips and thigh gaps and all that kind of thing. 
Okay, here is my curvy darling deer. Um, should we give her tattoos? I know we didn't like get that in the wheel, but oh look how cute that is. Oh my gosh, I didn't even know I had this. What's this one on the other side? Oh, that seems like totally a tattoo that she would get. All right, we're leaving it, we're leaving it. Okay, let's spin the wheel for style. Okay, here we go. So we got boho, Kardashian, hipster, streetwear. What does that say? Oh, rocker, and I think that's goth. Okay. Kardashian? I feel like that doesn't fit her at all. That makes me sad. Okay, let's see. Let's just see. And if I end up really not liking it, I'm gonna re-roll. I am going to do it. So how do the Kardashians dress? Don't they wear like stuff like this? I mean, she doesn't look bad. I just kind of figured her to be like a boho or like a, a hipster type of chick. That's definitely Kardashian. You guys, I'm gonna re-roll this one. I really don't like the Kardashians, so don't hate me, but it's my channel. <laughs> I'm gonna only re-roll one thing, just one thing. All right, let's do it again. I swear if we get it again, I'm gonna scream. Rocker? That's not what I expected for her either. Oh my God. Okay, well we can't re-roll anymore, so. All right, let's see what type of rocker stuff I have. I don't even know, like, what what is rocker? What the heck is that? Like, uh, punk? There's, like, this shirt. I've used it a couple times. Uh, it's very rocker. I mean, this is a Slayer shirt, for Pete's sake. So... <laughs> Maybe we'll go with that if I can't find anything better. Okay, now let's find you some bottoms. It's pretty long. I actually think that was a full body, wasn't it? It was! Oh my gosh, okay. So you would have to wear leggings with that then. Um, let's see what we got here. We got some regular old tights. Um, this actually looks really good on her. She's really cute. Um, fishnets, perhaps? That's definitely rocker, but I think I like the regular tights better. Yeah, I do. We'll do a few outfits. I love this custom content. It's tights that come in four shades. I think that's so amazing. Okay, and then as far as shoes go, I would assume Vans, right? That's, that's pretty rocker, I think. Or maybe like combat boots? That's not bad. Let's do another outfit just for funsies because I know that I have some like band stuff in here. I think this one literally says rock on it. Hang on. It does. Oh my god. Okay, maybe we're gonna have to go with that. Let's see what else there is really quick. Just to make sure I'm not missing anything. Oh yeah, the Nirvana shirt. That looks good on her too. Oh, Bowie. Mm -hmm. May the force be with you. That's so random. Should we do the Bowie shirt or the, the jacket one? Oh, we could do both. Yeah, let's add another outfit and just pop that on. Okay, as far as bottoms go, probably just some black jeans, right? Or like a high-waisted skirt. Oh my god, that's cute! Uh -huh, I actually really like that. There's a high-waisted skirt, there's some shorts, some... Whoa! Wide-legged pants. Leather pants, cute! There's some black jeans with like rips with some fishnets. That's cute. 
Oh, there's the pants with the chain. I love the pants with the chain. Okay, let's try those. <laughs> Uh-oh, her feet are gone. Oh, no! I like the high-top vans, but I think I like the regular vans better. I don't know. Let's see. And then maybe she could have the fishnets underneath so that we can see them on her ankles. That's pretty cool. What do you guys think? I think she's cool. Okay, let's work on this last outfit. Uh, so for this one, maybe she can like wear a skirt. Let's see. Aww. That is so cute. There's also these pants, which I'm obsessed with because you can get them with like little um, writing, writing on them or like hearts. So cute. Hmm. I don't know though. I don't know if they're looking good with this jacket, so maybe not. <laughs> okay, I really like these shorts, so we're gonna go with that and then... Oh man, I just wanna like put Vans on her, like, constantly. <laughs> but maybe we should switch it up a little bit and put her in heels for this outfit? I don't know, let's see. There are like these cool boots with the red, um laces which i like a lot they match her outfit like perfectly whether these like these like chunky um oh my gosh i love those i think we're gonna have to go with those they just go so well with the outfit okay yep 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 now let's give her nails for every outfit <laughs> Red nails for that one, and then for this one, maybe like teal nails or green. Yes! I love that. Okay, and then for this one... Mm, how about just black? Yeah, that looks really cool. And then I think she needs some jewelry for this outfit. Um, I'm getting really into this. I actually love her so much. I was a little bit worried. But no, she's she's so cool. She's awesome. Oh, that's adorable. There's this like long one. There's this one, which I think is so dope. That one, or this one, or this one. Her neck's a little too thick for that one, I think. Hmm, I don't know. Which one did we like? That one's cute. Yeah, that one for that one. And then maybe we can like change her eyeliner color for this one and do, let's see, what eyeliner did we use? Where is it, where is it? This one, okay. Maybe we can do like red for this outfit or blue. I think I like blue. Yeah, that looks really nice. And then we can change her, um, her lip gloss color as well. Or maybe she can wear like a matte lipstick with this outfit. Like a nude. Yep. Yep, I love it. Okay, and then for this outfit, I love the pink lip gloss and I love the pink eyeliner. So I think we'll keep that the same. And then this one we'll do maybe the red. Let's see how it looks. Yeah, let's do the red for this one. And then for her lipstick, maybe red lipstick? I think so. Okay guys, let me make sure that there's no more wheels that we need to spin. I don't think there is. We got hair color, skin color, body type, face, eye color, makeup, fashion, body, hair length, body details. Should we spin for her creative sim traits or should we just randomize them here? Let's spin them. Cause this is a spin the wheel challenge. <laughs> okay, foodie. Okay, foodie and... Family-oriented. Isn't that cute? 
Why am I not seeing family oriented? Can teenagers not be family oriented? Or am I just like stupid and I just can't find it? Huh, I guess teenagers can't be family oriented. So let's give it another spin. <laughs> Hopefully this next tray we can use. Lazy. She's lazy, y'all. I don't think I've ever used this trait in my life. Okay, she's a lazy foodie. That's something else. <laughs> All right, and her aspiration, can, is there a wheel for that? Ah, goals, okay, here we go. Successful. So what does that mean exactly? Fabulously wealthy? Okay, since we got family oriented for the first one, let's give her the big happy family aspiration. Cool. All right, and her name is one, two, three, Amara, one, two, three. Amara Sylvester. And I think that there's one we can spin for her voice. There is. Okay, let's give this a whirl to wrap it up. Medium, soft, soft. I don't know what soft is. I think that's pretty good. I think that's soft. Okay, and there's no wheel for her walk style, unfortunately. So, should we give her this one? <laughs> Cute. Will she walk like this everywhere? I mean, she is lazy, so it does fit, but no. I'll just give her the normal walk style. Okay, you guys, here is Amara Sylvester, a rocker. <laughs> I will upload her to the gallery if you guys are interested. I hope you enjoyed this episode so much. I love you, and I will see you in my next video. Oh, and don't forget to comment down below and let me know what you think of her. Is she a good candidate for Max or no? <laughs> Leave me a comment, let me know. Love you.